Praise the Lord. Happy Easter. Happy Resurrection Day every day. Um, Feliz Pasquale for my Spanish speaking brothers and sisters, you know, and just sitting here walking around in my mind and was having a reasonable conversation with the presence of God. And I've always wondered how those of us who profess and confess and attest to believing in the resurrection, this is a statement question, how, why is it or how come or how can it be or why is it such that, this is a statement question, um, uh, uh, pertaining and concerning those of us, uh, people of the way, those of they, uh, and they were first called Christians in Antioch, but the believer, why is it that those of us who confess and profess and attest that we believe in the resurrection, this is a statement question. It's a statement as well as a question. Like fraternal twins, I'm a fraternal twin. My mother had two sets of twins, 13 months apart, uh, uh, and I just, this is a statement question. I just, uh, it's something of a, an enigma, a quagmire, a, 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 a riddle. I, I don't know. Why is it that those of us who profess, confess, attest, protest, contend for our faith, those who say they believe in the resurrection, why is it that, this is a statement question, why is it or how come or how can you want to live forever eternal life but nobody wants to die no one wants to die to hate no one wants to die to racism right being racial no one wants to die to murder, rage, evil. No one wants to, wants to die to harming little children. No one wants to die to war, famine, or disease. So why is it that everybody wants to live forever, but no one, nobody, no person wants to die? I mean, there's suicide, which is a self-inflicted wound upon one's soul. And it's detriment to where you're going to spend eternity at. We serve an internal and an eternal God. We serve an internal and eternal God. He's not external. So why is it that everybody wants to live but nobody wants to die? We must die to oneself. Every day I must take insult, assumption, injury, and, and take it and die and be resurrected of the presence of God the next, the same day for the next day. And you get it over and over and over again and that is not oh my darling knock three times on the ceiling if you want me that 72 times a minute it's this thing called life systolic diastolic the heartbeat up down up down up down people like cannonball sometimes you feel like a nut sometimes you don't but again as i uh, those of you who profess confess attest contend those of us who call ourselves we are believers we're not understanding the bible says in all thy getting get understanding the bible also says there's a way in Proverbs 16 and 25 that seems right to a man or woman but the end thereof are the ways of death the same right way as I leave this alone, why is it that everyone, every person, those of us, those are they, the people of the way, and they were first called Christians in Antioch or, and or the believer. Why is it that we believe in eternal life, resurrection, but nobody wants to die, to hate, die, to evil, die, to being politically crazy, die, to being physically crazy. Mentally crazy, emotionally crazy, spiritually crazy, supernaturally crazy, economically crazy, fanatically crazy, finally crazy, <laughs> prayerfully crazy. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. Lord, have mercy. As I leave this people. But why is it, why is it, why is it everybody wants to live forever? Everybody, everyone who believes in the resurrection, those are they, the people of the way, the believer. Why is it that everybody wants to live? But nobody wants to die. Happy Resurrection Day every day. Happy New Year's every day as a year ago. Feliz Pasquale. Happy Easter. <laughs> to all of us who believe. And we thank the Lord for this breath and this breath and this one too. Thank you, Lord. Uh, so many people want to live forever. 
but they don't want to die. Help me, Lord. Why is it that people want to live forever, but nobody wants to die to hate? Uh, nobody wants to die to be mean. Help me, Lord. It's a question statement. Why is it everybody wants to live forever doing wrong? Live forever doing people uh, 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 unkind and impolite. You want to live forever. You don't want to grow old. You're afraid of age. You get mad because you see a lion on gray hair. I've had white hair gray hair since I was 14 years old. Some gray hair I've earned and some gray hair I've given. But why is it, as I leave this alone, this litmus, litmus paper test of life, why does those are they, the people of the way, and they were first, first called Christians at Antioch, uh, 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 the believer, the supernatural, the spiritual being. Why is it that we want to live forever, but nobody wants to die? They are back to back. They're fraternal twins. You can't have one without the other, as I leave this alone. Happy Resurrection Day. May our Father in heaven resurrect you on the inside. Happy Resurrection Day. May our Father in heaven resurrect your connection with him. Happy Resurrection Day. May our Father reconnect with you on the inside, eternally, internally, morally, verbally, finally. May our Father in heaven reconnect you with those of they, those you've disconnected from. May our Father in heaven heal all the broken family, broken marriages, broken relationships all across this land. Statement question. How can you want to live forever? But you don't want to die to oneself. You don't want to die to evil. You don't want to die to racism. You don't want to die to bigotry. You don't want to die to uh, being politically crazy, physically crazy, emotionally crazy, mentally crazy. You don't want to be want to die to being racially crazy. How is it everyone who believes in the resurrection? How can it you be that you want to live forever? But no one wants to die. I thank the Lord for this breath. And this breath, like St. Mark, and this breath, when he spoke of Jesus or Esau, and this breath, every, every verse, and this breath, the conjunction, and this breath, and Jesus did this, and the Lord did that. So I thank God, our Father, for this breath, and every breath I have in me, and this breath, I'm going to try to do brother better every time, and this breath, and this breath. Why are people living and breathing this breath to do wrong and to be evil? This breath to be racist and evil? And this breath to mistreat your husband and wife? And this breath to be mean or indifferent? And this breath to be intolerable and crazy? To, and this breath to be discriminatory or prejudiced? As I leave this be, why is it that we want to live forever, but no one wants to die to hurting one another, to pain and immorality? And why do people... Want to live forever to do people wrong. And I thank the Lord for my funeral every day that I must attend and go to. And take insult and injury and assumption. And come back for more the next day. The miracle is that you keep on going even after you've taken a licking. A beating. The miracle is the resurrection is that we keep on going after we've been injured and divorced and mistreated and thrown and blown away. So I thank our Father in heaven for this breath. And this breath. And this resurrection. And this resurrection. In this resurrection, thank you, Father, for blessing me to die as I look forward to eternal life that I already have, that's already started, because I am a believer. I'm not an understander. God bless you and keep you as my prayer. Feliz Pasquale, happy Easter, and happy Resurrection Day. Every day, peace, one, amen, and this breath.